top you what I'm on. Nigga, get your own, tryna pick a nigga bone. Wait to buy the skip, boy, I had a good day. Mess your people. Shit just got real, things are getting intense now. I hear you talking about we a lot, or you speak French now. There hasn't been no sun, but I'm just gonna wear this because I'm not gonna, gonna waste $30. I don't care there ain't no sun outside. I'm wearing this shit. Oh, bro, this LA rain is no joke, dog. No joke. Holy shit. Thank you, God, because you be snapping. You, you, you be snapping with me like, God, you really be snapping with me like, especially on my birthdays, like, I feel your presence with me so crazy on my birthdays. Like, I feel God with me crazy on my birthdays. Like, every day I feel God, but on my birthdays, bro, it's crazy. Like, I love you so much, God. I love you. I love everyone that wished me happy birthday. I wish... All y'all have a great rest of your life, a great afterlife, a great eternity. You know what I mean? Like, that's the type of stuff I'm on. But for real, for real, though, bro, and it's crazy, too. I make these little transition videos. It's not even little. I make these transition videos or videos of me just living through life and, like, getting older and stuff because it's just crazy to see, like, 10 years ago or I think in the first video I was 15, so... Eight years ago, that's where I was at. And now I'm here. Like, And even at 15 and all those ages, bro, before, I was still blessed. Like, there's just new blessings every year, every month, every day. And it's just like, God love us for real. Like, I don't think y'all understand. Like, God love us for real. Like, like, God loves you crazy, bro. And, like, I realize I be blocking my own blessings when I don't realize that and I think that God hates me and the world is out to get me in like type deal because then that's what I'm going to perceive the world as but God don't hate me or you like God literally is like if you just trust in me I'm going to give you everything and more like what you think you can get I'm going to give you times a thousand do you know what I mean like it's crazy bro but it's not crazy because that's just love like if you love someone you know like love does anything with that person and will Go above and beyond, like, wow. But yeah, y'all, this is me at 23. I'm literally in Cancun. This is not my last day. I leave tomorrow, but I've had a freaking blast. Like, 
I went jet skiing for the first time and it was freaking amazing. Like I literally said to my girlfriend, I was like, all I want to do is jet ski. Like if I jet ski today, I can literally die happy. And I'm not going to die, but I'm happy. Like I'm so happy. I was just in the water, bro, screaming like, it's my birthday. Let's go. The energy was crazy. I've had mad energy all day. I've just, I've been good. I've been good. I've been great. Actually, I've been great. Um, yeah, it's a blessing, man. But uh, I was about to show you all the fit. Why not? I'll, I'll throw the fit in with this video as well because I'm just doing that. Doc Martins on. Doc Martins. Pleasure X Doc Martins. We got the vape. Cargos. Yes, sir. Ski. And we got this shirt. Yes, sir. Ski. Yes, sir. Ski. Yes, sir. Ski. Like, do y'all see how I'm coming? Like, I'm blessed. Yes, sir, ski. This is so tight. You could rip it off and then it says, I don't know if I could see. It says, um, ape. By bathing ape. And then you can put it back on and it's the, the ape. Yes, sir, ski. Yes, sir, ski. Blessed. Super blessed. Thank you, God. Thank you, everybody that is in my life. Also, that's been blessing me. Because it's not like it's God, but it's the people that God uses to bless me as well. So thank you to everyone that showed me love, giving me money for this trip, giving me words of inspiration during this day, this trip, my life, everything. Like, I love y'all for real, for real. But yeah, I don't want y'all to see this and be like, oh. This was flexing on me like, nah. I'm literally showing you what you could do too, bro. Like, like dead ass. I'm not saying tomorrow you're gonna wake up and you know start booking flights and stuff. But it's not. It's not even about the flights. It's about the faith in God and like there's other areas to boss up in. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, I'd be so blessed. Not even just from like materialistic stuff, but like my mind, my headspace, my the people I have around me, my the energy around me. Like, bro. I'm being so serious. I'm not trying to sound like a Christian, you know what I'm saying? Like, we're re super religious um, guy, because I'm not. But I believe in God wholeheartedly. I believe in trusting in everything is going to be okay. Having your headspace correct and doing things that... Okay, look. Because I can't be like, God, help me. And I'm not putting in no... I'm not putting in my 50%. Like, whenever I get blessed, it's because I'm doing my part. Do you see what I'm saying? Like, you just got to... It's like, say, I'm like, God... I wanna, like I was literally, bro, on this trip, bro, I'm gonna be so honest with y'all. I had no money, like I had no money. Yeah, I, I had no money when I got on my flight. I had no money. When I got on my flight, look, y'all gonna understand God real quick. I, so I missed my first flight, right? I missed my first flight. So when I was at the airport, they were like, you either have to buy this flight or we're, you're basically gonna lose your 400 bucks that you spent on this flight. So I was like, I'm gonna have to just buy another flight. So I already spent 400 on a flight previously, back in like July. She told me I have to spend 275 to get another flight the next day. I was like, fuck it. I literally had $280 in my account. You see what I'm saying? And then I had some money in cash. So I had to, I blasted my 275. It left me with like $5 because I had 281 in my account. It left me with $5 and some cents in my on my card. And then the cash, I needed to, I had to take a taxi to my mom's. The taxi was like 70 bucks and then i had to use another like i had to use more money to get back to the airport the next day to catch my new flight so what i'm trying to tell you is i was broke i had no money and the cash that i had i was supposed to pay the rent for this spot with so that wasn't like free money like i had no money so literally i was in my head i was like should i even go to the airport for this flight like i don't have money like it's not gonna work out and then something told me bro like like God told me like just go like this is a test of your faith just go so I literally I had to use my credit card because I had no cash on my card I used a credit card to get to the airport I ubered there I was like okay <laughs> I, I have to trust God at this point because I can't do this by myself I didn't I, my dad had already given me money my mom had already given me money my girlfriend had already given me money I've already used my credit card like there was no other options to get funds right so I literally got on the flight 
and I was stressing. I, looked, I kept checking my account to see if I was gonna get some money because I was waiting for um, some money to hit from school because I go to school, I get um, FAFSA. And I kept checking, it said it was supposed to be in my account like that day or the day, or the day prior. I was like, okay, where is it, where is it, where is it? I was stressing because if I got to Cancun with no money, I was like, it wasn't like, no, like how am I gonna get the spot to, you know what I'm saying? So I ended up, I had to go to Salt Lake City, Utah for a connecting flight and then go to Cancun because that's just how it was set up since I missed my first flight. It wasn't a straight shot to Cancun anymore. I had to go to Salt Lake City now. So I ended up in Salt Lake City, Utah. And as soon as I touched down, when I got phone service, something told me, check your account, right? Mind you, I went to Salt Lake City with no cash, $5. I was like, bro, if I, like, if I don't have money here, I'm, I'm over with. I checked my account. Like, I literally, the whole flight, though, I was stressing, but I was like, nah, don't stress because God got me. Like, I don't have to be like, where's the money going to go? Like, no. That's why God says, like, if you have God, you have peace. Because even when in situations where you should be stressing, like, where's the money? God is like, just trust me and you'll have peace because you don't have to stress because you know I got you. You see what I'm saying? So, I got, I got to the, we landed. I literally got connection. Check my account. I had racks. <laughs> like racks like like racks and i literally just i literally almost cried like i wanted to cry but I, I don't know if i did cry i think i did cry i'm not gonna cap i was yeah i cried i cried i got there i was just like wow like god like god bro but yeah i'm just saying that to like say that I don't have all my stuff figured out. I just trust in God, bro. Like, simple. Cause like I had five dollars coming here, like five dollars. <laughs> There's so many more testimonies, bro. But I might save it. I'm probably gonna save it for another video because I don't want to get into it right now. But yeah, y'all. Like, it's possible with God. Like, I can't do all this by myself. I literally need God. God is with us, bro. Just tap into God. Like, that's all you got to do. You don't got to ask for God to come into you. God is already with you. Like, when you realize that, you don't, your life is so much simpler. You don't got to pray and beg and ask for this because God already got you. Like, just have faith and just, you know what I mean? Like, I'll catch myself being like, God, please, I need this. I need this. And then I'll be like, dude, why are you begging for something if you know that God already has you? If God already got me, I don't got to beg because it's coming. I just got to have patience. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, yo. That's my little piece. Again, 23, we are in Cancun with it. We feel good. Just drop music. Check out my SoundCloud. I'm gonna drop the link in the description. I dropped two songs for my birthday. We are elevating. We are evolving. We are evolving, y'all. But yeah, I'm gonna catch y'all on the next one. I hope this inspired y'all to like trust in God, be who you are. Go after what you want. Don't have doubt, don't have fear. I mean, you gonna have it, but you can't let it stop you from doing what you want to do. Trust me. Trust me. That's all that. The reason I am where I am, you know what I'm saying? I'm not even anywhere close to where I'm going to be. But we're worried about the, the now, not the future. But the reason I am here where I am here now, the reason I have the mental that I have now is because I trust in God and I listen to what God tells me to do. And I put aside my what, what I think is the best. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a human. I make mistakes. But at the end of the day, trust God. Period. There you go.